Hi there YouTube, James and John here once again with another speed test for you. Today is a real doozy. It's the iPhone 7 versus its predecessor, the iPhone 6S. So let's just go for it. On the left, we have the older iPhone 6S running iOS 9, while on the right, we've got the brand new iPhone 7 running iOS 10. James, talk us through the test. So we have 10 apps running on each of these phones, the exact same 10 apps. We're on the third one there right now, that is Spotify, and we're neck and neck for both of these phones. We're gonna run through the apps one more time straight away afterwards to see how well they've buffered in the background, if they're still running in the background. And there we go, Spotify is taking some time there, isn't it? It is, yeah. Um actually a hair quicker on the 6S to mm. start with, and they're both neck and neck, which is surprising, because the iPhone 7 has a brand new A10 Fusion quad-core processor versus mm. the 6S's older dual-core A9 offering, and Apple is promising big things from the new iPhone 7 in terms of power and performance. It's Definitely. saying it's a lot quicker, it's saying it's the fastest phone around, but at the moment, that's not completely obvious from this particular test, but I think we'll start to see the iPhone 7 slowly try to pull forward as we get through. Yeah, it is worth noting as well that we're running iOS 9 on the iPhone 6S on the left. You can get iOS 10 on that phone already, but when we did this test, it was a bit too early to get that, and the iPhone 7 is into its second lap. They're both the are now, yeah. yep. But the iPhone 7 is slightly ahead, there's not much in it, which is mm. an impressive performance really by the 6S, which is still running well after a year. Um, but maybe ha have Apple sort of overhyped their own processor? I don't know, this is this is a basic test. These mm. phones aren't full of images and apps and music, which will take its toll on the performance yeah. of it. And we expect the iPhone 7 through longer use to perform better than so the here's, 6S. So here's the iPhone 7 finishing up. That's one minute and 37 seconds. And the iPhone 6S is just behind at one minute, 41 seconds. So there you have it, YouTube. The iPhone 7 wins, but only just. Mm. Uh, four seconds between it, we were thinking maybe a bit more of a difference. Apple really bigged up its new yeah. quad-core A10 Fusion processor at the launch, mm. but that's only a real quick test. It's not overly in-depth. It's just our little speed test to give you a flavor of the speeds of the handsets, um, and we expect the performance in general day-to-day -day use when you fill up that new iPhone with all your apps, your music, your games, etc. The performance difference will show through even more. Do check out our full review on the website, techradar.com. It looks great. Um, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let us know in the comments below also uh, what you think of the speed test. Uh, is the iPhone 7 really worth it? Let us know your thoughts, and uh, we'll see you again very soon.